Hi guys, it's me again. So today I'm in my studio and I'm gonna show you how I make songs because a lot of my fans have been asking, how do you do it, you know? And also um, I wanna explain a bit about the emotional part of, you know, what I put into songs because us artists were often misunderstood and I just wanna like clear up some stuff. So first, what you need is a computer. So mine is a bit broken. If I try to open it more, it um, twitches, but um, it's okay, you can just balance it with your seal. Um, so, you need a computer. Then you need to choose an instrument. Um, it can be any instrument. You don't have to know how to play it. You will not be playing it. You will be taking what other people made and using that. So, I took bass. So, this is how it goes. You have a little bit of a repetitive bass thing. You like it, you know, you're like, this is cool. But it does need drums. So for drums, you could take any, but it's important that they are not from your culture. So as far away as possible. So take that, then have the bass be like a bit more muted in this case. So, you know, this is fun, but it doesn't really make me feel anything. And I don't know about you, but I love to feel things. So I thought, what could I include or who would I include in this song to reflect the feelings that I want to reflect and like send the message that I want to send to the world? So I thought about it and the answer was Little John. It's mostly Little John when I think about these things. Um, so I, I just got him on the song. So I took Little John, um, you know, just pitch it up a bit so it doesn't sound exactly like him. But now you have little John, I'm feeling things, I'm remembering things, you know. It's a little bit for the memories, but what's important is getting low. And then the getting low, you have to loop and delay so that it keeps going forever to symbolize that the going low, or getting low, never stops. Um, because it's kind of, you know, that's a circle of life. And then this also was very interesting. I chose that to symbolize shaking ass. So, dun, 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 dun. so then you go back on getting low because you can't forget about that. Now you're thinking I have to have like a fake buildup because it's a bit boring. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey. So yeah, you have a little fake out, but that does give you an idea. Like let's do a beat switch because I love beat switches. And, um, I was thinking, I just want to say fuck this genre and just make the song sound completely different as if it was made by Kanye West. Because, I don't know about you, but the more random people on the song, the better. So even the bass is going to end soon. So then again, you don't have to do it yourself, just take Kanye type drums. do to avoid the scariness is um actually my friend showed me this video that um she took when she was nine years old that's on youtube um and i watched it i'll go down in history yay wasn't that amazing <laughs> and you know it's just so wholesome and so sweet and just supportive you know it was amazing so you want to make sure you add that to the song and the parts that make you feel kind of scary it's like it's about your inner child and you know that unconditional love that we often forget